but even the creativity has been quite lacking so of late. Well, we are underway right here at the MTN Filippo Mondi Stadium. Kickoff between Police Football Club dressed in the blue and white with the camouflage up there. Well, we can't... <laughs> don't make that mistake, especially in this kind of circumstances. Long body, a player brought down right at the edge of the box area, and the referee or lawyer points to a free kick, Davis Cassidy. He hasn't studied a number of games, of but them. today entrusted with being the spearhead of the attack. Yeah, of course. I guess they realize that um, with this size, could be a bit of a handful for this. Uh, for Ashraf Mugume, can he deliver the goods? Oh, actually, even Arafat Usama seems to have some intentions on that ball. Mugume goes straight for it and delivers right off the onset. The concentration was primed. That is locked and loaded and makes no mistake. Skessi is in the lead. Yeah, what a brilliant execution that is um, uh, for a former police player scoring against the former side. You could see he did not celebrate uh, because of uh, the attachment, of course, the history he has with police. But that was good execution. Good captain. Skessi sees. Beno Chan makes a clumsy clearance, and that has been one of their biggest problems. A chance here, that's a penalty. Referee points to the spot. The penalty considered by Usama Arafat, but the captain will have to take the blame for that one. Very clumsy play from Benjamin Ochan, despicable. And once again, the old demons rear their heads. In, and that's why he's not on the lineup now. Benjamin Ochan, who might be Juma Marinya against Benjamin Ochan, races up, laces up, and sends the goalkeeper the wrong way. And right there and then, salutes the police fans. 1-1 one, one in little one. Um, game for many fans, I'm sure, that are in the stadium anticipated where they're going to be goals, where it's going to be end-to-end end -end action. And we haven't seen the end-to-end -end action yet, but we've seen the goals, and you think that that should be a catalyst for great things to come in this game. With players um, just having three strikers on the field, but I don't think that that's the right formation. Well, for a chance them. here! There was a backheader! And what will Cassidy have as his excuse for this one? The what he sold should be able to convert that opportunity. Kadu does his best with the backheader. This is it in for him. A beautiful chance for a half volley to leave the goalkeeper lying at his mercy. Begin here from Denis Siguma trying to shepherd that defense. Now gets Hamatachai on the move, who delivers a beautiful cross there and it's intercepted. Brian Majuega with another bite of the cherry, pops it in. Davis Cassidy with a chance. And again, not on target. <laughs> 35 minutes of the game played. Long ball up front here. Patrick Henry Kadu tries to unleash a thunderbolt there. But once again, to the rescue, Eric Senjome. Beautiful football now coming in from Police FC, getting into their gears. Kalanda Machete teases for Barinha over the bar. But the flag had already gone for an offside. His teammates are, and that makes him a top player. Chance comes up here, and that ball is headed just off target. That would have been an inspired substitution. Right, here he comes, the skipper, Tony Maweje, sets the ball back in, looking for support from Ruben Chimera, tries to release the ball out here. A chance could be coming up here by the goalkeeper, Benjamin Ochan. With you anytime, anywhere, from Star Times, the official title sponsors of the Star Times Uganda Premier League. Shot again, Ashraf Mugume. Once a warning. Both are trying to be more aggressive, even though the rhythm is yet to really return. But you can see the reaction that nobody is pressing the ball on that penalty area, and it's the second time it's happening in quick succession. He's and cross here, decides to go for the shot himself, and it's palmed away. That was a teasing shot there for a moment. Everybody thought the cross was coming. Tony Maweje had a right thumping about that one, just put his foot in it, really riveting there. And Benjamin Ochan. Had to be very good here to actually keep that one out. It was turning in. And now that's a corner. Corner kick coming up. Finally having to do some defending in this second half. As the ball is flicked back in. Mavino Shaba has a chance here. And he balloons the ball high and wide. High and wide. And Abdallah Mubiru cannot be... Well, he first looked at the ball. Decides to bring a close to this particular game. And...